What? Those bubbles. I think there's something wrong with my ducks. They blow bubbles. That's why her name is Bubbles. She does it all the time, but that's the first time I've seen him do it. It's funny. It's Carter's pigeon. Anybody knows the type of pigeon that is? Let me know in the comments, because uh, he had a pair of them and something got in and ate our boy. But uh, I have no clue what that bird is called. Like, my kid brought it home and I, I, I couldn't tell you what it is. I know it's a pigeon, but I don't know what kind of thing. She's got fancy feathers all the way up her feet. Like, yeah, if you guys could help me out, let me know what kind of bird that is. Like, what type of pigeon is that? Because I'd really like to know. I wouldn't mind getting some more of them. They're pretty pretty cool. I like them. Some peepers. That guy's starting to fly around. There's a lot of peepers in here. The pigeons, guys. Have you seen more of these? Let me know if you guys want me to like take you on a, one of my little hunting excursions. When I go and trap these guys, I mean, I normally do it by myself, so it's not all that easy to videotape, but I'm sure I could talk somebody into filming for me while I trap them. And it's kind of hard. They are pretty finicky when and you gotta be quiet, you gotta be slow, you got I mean there's a lot. I don't know how well the video would turn out. But if I get these other jobs here in town, those ones in the silos I should be able to tape. I gotta get a GoPro or something, something I can strap on. I just use my phone right now. So it's not the best quality of video I'm sure. But I mean gotta start somewhere, right? So yeah. You guys like the pigeons you guys want to see more videos of the pigeons i mean i'm here every day so i could probably get you guys some videos every single day check on the different birds and we do have some nests that are starting to get eggs in we have there's a nest and that side of the wall there's that basket right there there's two eggs in there so far and then on the other side of this wall here on the peacock pen there's that first set of wild ones that we had their babies are doing pretty good i checked on this morning you guys want to see more stuff like that just let me know in the comments and uh i mean like i say i'll get the content you guys want for sure sitting here all day uh, just something about it they're starting to get used to me a little bit these guys are definitely getting used to me already um, right here <laughs> hi bubbles I don't know what we're gonna call you launch pad huh launch pad and bubbles right launch pad was a duck yeah yeah yeah, it was a duck that flew a plane and crashed all the time. Oh, yeah. See, this guy here, he actually comes up to me quite a bit. I should band him so I know which one he is. But every time I try to go near him, they all go into the other coop and then they get mixed up. And I don't know. I should probably do a head count, huh? I don't know how many birds we even have in here now. There was 30-something last time I counted, but I did pick up... Me and Carter caught two squeakers yesterday and put in here. So there's, I don't even know, I couldn't tell you, I guess. We could count, but they're all doing, they're calming down now, so I don't really want to freak them all out. Those chicken nest box, they seem to spend a lot of time in it, but nobody's actually laid a nest in there yet. Squeaker on the left, an adult bird on the right. Let's say for you guys that don't know, if you look, see the color difference in their eyes. The one on the right has those really bright orange. The one on the left has a real dark brown eye. 
they don't uh, get brighter till they get older. That's how you can tell sometimes. Uh, and there's other things if you grab them normally, like underneath their wings, their feathers aren't completely developed sometimes. But yeah, that's the big key. They got dark brown eyes. They're definitely a young bird. And I mean, look at the size difference too. And that one on the right's a female. She's not all that big, but she's a lot bigger than him. So you got some of them big males in there. I really think we have twice as many males as females. They seem to be the ones that are easier to catch. I don't know why, but for some reason we catch a lot of males. And then there's some spots that I don't touch the females either if there's, you know, I see a bird on a net. I mean, some, I, the males take care of them too, I guess. So at nighttime, it seems more like the females are on the nest and I don't touch them if they're on a nest. So I mean, unless it's a job that I'm doing that, you know, requires me to, but normally I'm doing it for myself. So pick and choose, try not to take both parents so that way they can still raise the babies hopefully oh, what's going on here we got the zoomies oh it's in that water you're drinking there duck <laughs> yeah see i knew that was a big male I get some bands so I can start banding these guys up and know which ones are which because I can't let any of these big adults loose but all the squeakers I should be able to fly which would be nice I'd like to fly them and even race them someday yeah. I mean I've heard of feral pigeons winning races so I mean they're supposed to be good short distance flyers so and I don't know a whole lot about the whole racing deal yet so but it'd be something fun for me and my kid to get into. I know Carter's really enjoyed the birds. He's always wanted to race pigeons since he was little, and I talked about having pigeons when I was younger, so maybe he'll be something we can do together and definitely enjoy it. Oh, you can't tell from back here. But that guy over there, that guy. And this big camera's not good in this light. That guy right there on top of that, above that one there in the middle, he has got like a red tint to him. He's really cool. When the sun hits him in here, it's like, I don't know, weird purple and orange. Like, I can see him better when I zoom out. Yeah, I definitely gotta get a better camera, guys. I get a better camera, I'd definitely be able to get you guys some better videos. Probably more because I'm always self-conscious of these things. That's why you guys don't see me on the videos ever. I don't really, I don't know. I tried, Carter recorded me a couple times and I just, I don't, just can't be in front of the camera yet. I don't know what it is, but I just don't like it. So, you guys don't have to look at my ugly mug. I can still make videos. You don't have to see me. These guys. That's why I moved the other water dish into there, so that way those guys didn't have to fight with the ducks, because these guys dirty it up pretty quick. Yeah. Yeah. Hopefully. Still got a few months of some warm weather, so. All right, there's one of the squeakers from last night. Or yesterday, yesterday. A little early, but this guy actually was uh, out of the nest and something had got him and like tore his feathers off the back of his neck. So I didn't want him getting eight. I'm sure something would have got him. The spot that I actually get some of these guys from, I mean, it's like a, it's a sad sight to see. Like most of the babies don't make it down there. So I try to get them as as soon as I possibly can. I actually have a few females in here that feed all the little squeakers that can't fly yet for some reason. I don't know. I might have caught one of their parents at some time. I don't know. But there's two of them that take care of quite a few of the babies. So they still get fed. I don't know if that's common or not. I mean, you guys know. Let me know. But 
All right, we're about 10 minutes into this video. I gotta get more chores done, guys. So, uh, yeah. Let me know what you guys want to see, and I'll start making more videos. I'm trying to you know, stick to it. I know I went a week or two there without a video, but like I said, I had a bunch of stuff going on, so I will be more frequent with them now. So, yeah, leave a like, subscribe if you're not already, and uh, yeah, leave some comments. Let me know what you guys want to see. You guys want to go with me on some of my pigeon hunts? Leave it in the comment. I, I'll start taking guys with me and see what, if we can't get some videos of me catching these guys. I mean, obviously, I'm pretty good at it. I mean, there's only three, what, two, there's two pigeons in here that are paid for. All the rest are caught. I caught every single one of these guys with a net. Everyone, well, obviously not the guineas, but every pigeon you see in here was caught with a net. This guy's getting pretty good with me. Those two, I gotta ban them so I know they're up here. Maybe even put them in their own little thing. Look at that, those are all males on that top. Very last one of them, all males. I think the majority of these are males. And is there, I don't know, you guys let me know in the comments. Should I be put, should I put a divider in here? Maybe stop them from fighting as much? I mean, they don't seem to be too bad. I mean, nobody gets hurt or nothing, but. It is kind of, they do get pretty feisty. All right. Till next time, guys.